Okay, I'm going to demonstrate how to make hydrogen gas. First of all, we use our personal protective equipment, which is goggles, because if you get this crap in your eyes, you're probably blind. It's a very caustic solution. So I'm going to use three beer cans, Budweiser, Bush Light. Doesn't really make any difference. You can use pop cans as well. So show you they're ordinary cans. Okay, come on up close here. I'm going to show you down inside this container. Again, nothing special going on there. It's ordinary tap water we're putting in here. I'm going to put about a quarter of it down the bottom. I filled this before so I know approximately how much a quart of water is. And it'll continue making hydrogen as long as there's water to react with the chemicals. So it looks like about a quart there. Then we use our Drano, which is sodium hydroxide. Sodium hydroxide reacts with aluminum to release the hydrogen out of the water. And you need about 10 tablespoons full, and that's about what's left in this container. It should rock and roll pretty good when I uh, add the cans to it. You, Maybe once you add as much as you did yesterday. I say when you add uh, sodium hydroxide to your container, you can buy plain old lye off the internet. I know eBay sells it. Uh, there's people that carry it on eBay for a pretty reasonable price. It's a lot cheaper than buying Drano. But I bought Drano just so I could use it quickly and have it accessible here. We look down in there, see some green stuff. It's kind of doing its thing, getting started. I'm going to let that kind of settle down for a minute. While I'm doing that, I'm going to show you this is just an ordinary balloon that I have here. Nothing fancy. Can we get a lighter? No, not yet. Well, we don't have any. So I'm going to stick this balloon on the end of this hose. Throw us in a couple Okay. Now I'm going to put the cans in there. We should start reacting. You notice I used a stick just to stir it up, make sure all the chemicals get dissolved in there. Well, in case you didn't see this device up close, all it is a PVC pipe. One can, two can, three can. I'm going to stuff them down in there. If you notice right off the bat, nothing really happens. It just kind of sits there for a little bit. It takes a little bit of time for, for it to start. So we'll that. give it a minute here. You can already see it starting to like... See some fizz going on? Yeah, like, that's crazy. Kind of starts out like an aqua seltzer. I don't know if I like that. <laughs> Especially standing as close. I'd go boom, but it'd probably scare you. It's probably going to squirt on. Well, there. while we're waiting a minute here for that to get going, take a shot of the dart there. Mm -hmm. Anybody want to buy a nice 1966 Dodge Dart? Beautiful car. Can be yours. If the price is right. First man with $1,500 can drive it away. Oh, it's a beautiful car. Come on back over here. <laughs> much going on. Not a lot yet. It's just starting to fizz. Can you see the vapors coming up yeah. through there? Starting to bubble. Yeah, you can't reach it with that yeah, It took a few minutes the other day to get it going, but once it got going, it was bubbling real good. Were you here for it? Mm -mm. I think I had too much aluminum in there, not enough water, not enough space. It turned into Mount St. Helens. <laughs> that sucks. Can you smell it? Yeah. That's pretty good. Go ahead and stop it from that.